How you doing, everybody? This is Don the Baseman, aka Don M, and welcome back to Minecraft. Uh, this Minecraft Realms. Uh, this is the Halloween build that me and my friends did on our realm server. And so, well, let's get this party started. As you can hear, there is a thunderstorm going on. So it's perfect to go wandering around inside the the spookiness that we have. So, let's get this party started. Um, I have friends out here. This right here. Oh, I'll show you this first. This is the apartment that I had while we were building. Um, I expanded it out. As you can see, we have... Oh, we got a spooky house there. You can see another partial build over there. And, of course, friends. And kitty cats. You know, I really wish Mojang would let you uh, pet the kitties. And as you can see, the kitties are here to keep the creepers at bay. Alright. But yeah, this is my indoor pool. This is the indoor hot tub. When I go big, I go big. I like having all the luxuries. Bedroom. Nice little place, kitchen. Unfortunately, it's not stocked. So this is mine. Uh, over here is Vaughn's. Uh, Luke Sidna Vaughn's little, little hovel. Actually, I shouldn't say hovel. Uh, her her uh, college dorm apartment that she, uh, she had built. As you can see, it's unfurnished. Uh, her lease expired. She moved out. Took all her stuff with her. All right, so let's come in over this direction so we can start properly. Oh, hello, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Um, I have phantoms. It's never good to have phantoms. This is the entrance. This is where we started. And, uh... We're doing all our builds from here. This is our little staging area. As you can see, there's our uh, ender chest that we all shared. Uh, we'll be, I'll be showing our bases off here before too long. And let me take care of my little friend here. Bye-bye, friend. As you can see, I'm not very good at combat at the moment. For some reason, I just don't seem to be... Yeah, I saw that. I saw that. Uh... Alright, this right here, this gigantic headstone, is for, uh, was made by Viz, the creator of the giant snowman in the Christmas town. I thought I heard something behind me. Uh, so, he, this was his Halloween build. Unfortunately, due to timing, uh, we only had about a little over a week to get these things done. Poor guy was, was rather busy. So... This is all he was able to uh, get done in our time frame. However, I must say, it is an impressive feat. Again, as with the uh, Christmas Town Tour, I will be doing a flyover. Next! Oh yeah, here's our phantom catching area. I don't know exactly how it works, but I know that we have a few phantoms. And I would really like to know how it worked, how they were getting them in there, because I would get these guys wherever they ran off to. Yeah, that one. Uh, I'd get those guys stuck in there. This right here, this build was done by uh, uh, Cheyenne. And, uh, of course, you know, one of my friends, one of our friends uh, on the realms. She built a little... a little minecart attraction. So, let's take a ride, shall we? Whee! Ooh. Nice. Lava. Fire! Fire! Oh no! Okay, let's see. Zombie! Mm. Oh! Jesus! There was a zombie there. This is a short little ride. 
uh, next year. We plan on having a bit more time. Oh, uh, no. Bad zombie. Bad, bad zombie. How the heck? Oh, please tell me I didn't kill her name, zombie. Hold on. I gotta go back and check. Make sure her, her name, zombie, is still there. Yes. Her name, zombie, Mufasa, is still there. I don't know what she called the spider. But, uh, she was, she was able to, to put this together. We, as I said, we had about, maybe a little over a week, probably about a week. Uh, at least I did. Uh, I, I had a straight up week, uh, to do it. Um, I, I, uh, logged on immediately and, and started building my, my build. Which I am saving for the end. Actually, I want to show you. Yes. Elder Dragon, uh, Ender Dragon, Elder Dragon, Ender Dragon Heads. You know, if I'd have thought about it, I'd have brought some uh, redstone torches to power those things up so that they would be moving. And this right here, our buddy Robert, the owner of the uh, the server, aka Malrath, is oh hi hi creeper. How'd you... I gotta be careful, creepers. I don't like creepers. Uh, as uh, he put together. This little, this little attraction, skull, and the uh, building upon which it sets. Of course, as I said, I will be doing a fly around. Now his, he did something kind of interesting. I don't know how to do this yet. I don't know how to build a, one of those retractable doors like that. It's a double one from below that runs off of two buttons. I'm not sure how he did it, but it didn't matter. It's cool. I like it. This also was his little apartment as he was here building. And of course, we have a ghost. A little ghost lurking inside. Yeah. Moving on! Yeah, I just realized it's just, in essence, one button. Huh. Interesting. I, I just have to learn more redstone. Hello, kitty. Hi, kitty. Everything can pet you. All right. I'm going to come over here. Unfortunately, uh, this was our friend Lori's build. And uh, she was unable to finish it. Some things in life kind of got in the way, so she kind of ran out of time. Because uh, she had to deal with those. Unfortunately, her build is, uh, is a bit unfinished, though it was starting to look pretty cool. I liked it. I uh, wasn't sure exactly what it was going to be. I still, I still don't know. I still don't know. However, unfortunately, the, the, the time limit on the build has, has ended, and i got to go kill a skeleton before he shoots me. Ow. I failed. Thank you. Ah! Away with you! Thank you. Freaking spider coming over. Whacking me. Oh. Dang it! But I know that she was going to have something coming up into here to do something. I don't know quite what. I'll have to ask her and see if she can tell me. Or maybe she'll, she'll watch the video and be able to comment down below. Uh, but she had a couple of little areas. I'm kind of afraid I'm going to run into something. Yay! Oh. So, come up here. We have a launching point. So I'll be using this launching point uh, to leap off and do the tour. But until then, I'm going to walk through a spider web. Boy, that was brilliant of me. And yeah, I would literally log off of uh, log out of work. I'm working. I work from home uh, right now uh, due to the pandemic. And I literally would log off. Oh, I messed up. Uh, I would literally log off and just turn around, 
turn on my computer and start working on the Minecraft stuff. Uh, I would either do it on my computer back, uh, in my office, or I'd go and uh, fire up my Switch and build off of that. It's great that this this game is cross-platform, cross-play. Uh, this right here is our Skull of Baron Zombie, made by Lufsa Noban, aka Vaughn, my wife. So, you have the glasses. One is darkened, and the other is clear. And it is supposed to represent him being able to look in both worlds, the, wo the real world and the world of spirits. So let's go and take a look and see what's inside Baron Zombie's head. No, no way. Okay. Let me be smart so that nothing follows me. Now, it's been moved, but there was a skeleton horse in here. But after Halloween, uh, Vaughn moved it back to its uh, place at her base. And so, I'll be uh, doing the base tours and I'll make sure to point out uh, the the uh, skeleton horse that was in here. And uh, oh, did she take down the sign? She took down the sign. You could actually get rides on the skeleton horse. You could ride the skeleton horse. It just cost one measly soul. <laughs> and of course, as you can notice, um, I am at position six, six, six in. Baron Zombie's head. Boy, that's fitting, isn't it? And, uh, we have some adventurers caught in webs. Ah, uh, unlucky for them. I kind of wanted to... Uh, we, we thought about helping our bring some spiders up here, but eh, we decided that it was probably better to not do something that crazy. Uh, but as you can see, there's a treasure chest. The adventurers kind of wanted to get into the treasure chest. However, they didn't know they could just reach over here. Plus, it's already polluted. <laughs> it came along beforehand. And that's why there's no spiders. But, this right here is the skeleton head of Baron Zombie. Of course, you can't really see anything back there. But you can see how she made the, the fire in the eyes, nether rack, and uh, soul sand. Yeah, soul sand. I know my Minecraft stuff. Alright, back out we go. And now, we, we also had a takeoff point. She oh! Uh, we have briefing turned off, actually, right now. Uh, I did not expect that. I wish I had my shield. I tried, I tried doing my shield. But... I realized I didn't have it. Oh, I should have brought it. Oh, crap. Alright. Now for the final attraction. This sheep. Hi. This is the black sheep. He rules this place with a woolly hand. Well, hoof. And... Here's what remains of our pumpkin patch that we use to help build this. Now, as you can see, our little apartment complex that we had started. Don't ask me why I decided that I was going to build um, a window to look out. I just did. It was pretty pointless, honestly. <laughs> but, uh, fun, fun bit of information. We actually came in on uh, Halloween, and we played... Uh, we... Uh, Robert set the set the entire thing to night, and we played uh, Perpetual Night, and we played in around in here in our little area at night. So we had to fight the phantom. We had to fight. Uh, whoops! We had to fight zombies, as you can see. No, you're not forcing me off. But I wanted to show this. I'm actually very proud of this. This is this is the monstrosity that I built which is my haunted house, right? So, let's go in and have a pee. Take your card, as you can see I already have one. 
and enter if you dare. Of course, this is going to be a bit longer because, as I said, I uh, I built the I had lots and lots of time that I was able to dedicate to this because I really have no life. Uh, <laughs> Through the pandemic, we never never went out or much of anything, so I just spent my time, my entire week, uh, when I was off work building this. I dreamed about this build. I really did. It took me all week, as you can see. Nice. Nice and creepy. Nice and creepy. Jack-o'-lanterns. Couldn't figure out another way to light the place that didn't look kind of weird, so... But, yeah, nobody comes along and, and does the does any cleaning around in here. And of course, you gotta be careful coming around corners because uh, there are things lurking to kill you. Again. Now, moving along. Moving along. It's just a simple, simple little walk because this is actually the line to get into the ride. So, let's see what it looks like, shall we? Huh, another guy! Of course, yeah, I know what's going in. I mean, it is a cheeky little... little carnival ride. We went into the nether! Guys popping up! Oh no! Crossbow guys! Oh no! I forgot to load the snowballs. And we come out of the nether, and up here, interesting thing, my cart's on fire now. <laughs> this is my own personal cart, I'm not going to be returning it. Of course, secret exit, come out. It's not much, something fun to put together, and I was able to actually do some redstone, so I was pretty happy with that. So let me go and get to a launch point. Get to the launch point. Hi, little zombie villager. Oh, wrong one. It's over here. So let me do my quick little fly. Fly by. Alright. I'm gonna get shot. I know it. And here we go. Please don't get struck by lightning. Please don't get struck by lightning. I don't even hear any wind. As you can see, these builds are quite large. Took quite a bit of effort and ingenuity. There we go. Now I got some wind going. And I hope you enjoyed taking a look at our fun little build. We're not master builders by any stretch of the imagination. But we enjoyed ourselves. Enjoyed putting these together and playing around in the world. So let me see if I can land on... Uh, the top of of Robert's um Oh nope ah <laughs> I know there's scaffolding there but I gotta try. I gotta do it. Let's see if I can. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. There we go. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed our nice little tour. Our fun little time in our wonderful little build. And I hope that uh, that you uh, maybe get a little inspiration from it and find your own builds that you want to do. Or just enjoyed yourself as I, took, as I took you on this little tour. So once again, thank you very much for watching. And uh, hope to see you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Why can I never do emotes? Crap. <laughs>